Hey guys, welcome back to my shop. As I told in the last video, I'm planning to move to a new, bigger shop. Um, and for that, I need to move all the heavy machines. And I thought, okay, how can I do that? And I once saw a video of Adam uh, moving a shaper with a mobile gantry crane. And I thought that would be a really nice uh, piece of equipment to have uh, to move the machines to the new shop and also move them around in the shop. So um, yeah, I uh, plan to build one myself, so that will be the last little project in this small workshop and uh, another opportunity uh, to do some more TIG welding, which I really like. So uh, yeah, let's start.
after welding this to the uh, bracket um, it's a nice and strong weld um, but I did put it uh, not exactly square just a little bit to the left because the next step is welding this bracket in between and um, because of the welds it will shrink a little bit so I guess it will pull back a little bit uh, and after that it's, uh, it should be square but if not then during the welding I can adjust it a little bit um, pull it back even more or uh, I will have an adjustment on the top I will show you guys so as you can see I have a piece of aluminium uh, extrusion um, between both legs and um, I don't have it fixed at one end right now but um, if I notice that during the welding the legs pull in too much on each other I will fix it with this uh, piece in between so um, yeah then um, I'm pretty sure that it will end up uh, straight and I can adjust it during the weld after welding only two welds it pulled so much that it's now nice and straight so it pulled a little bit more than I thought um, so now I put uh, um, uh, extrusion uh, uh, to fix both legs but if I continue welding now this leg will just push back um, so first I need to weld this bracket on here to make it stronger so I will switch to this bracket and the other side um, and uh, yeah push pull and hopefully in the end everything will be square Next I will weld these two nuts in here, it's just to uh, uh, take up the play in the tubes, uh, the main force will be on the 20mm bolt so it's not to hold it down, it's just to press it to one side um, and you see the, the welding line of the tube is over here so there's the sharp edge on top here um, and I don't want to press it against the sharp edge because then it will still be able to move a little bit so I make sure I press it down so I will weld these on the on the edge So guys, the main parts of the gantry crane are ready, uh, but I need to think about a solution to move the crane up and down and to slide in and out of each other and uh, yeah, I need to do some more thinking and machining, but uh, yeah, I will, uh, decided to split this uh, project in two uh, videos because I don't want to make these videos too long. So uh, that was it for now and hope to see you next time. Bye bye.